My name is Eileen and I work at one of the largest defense contracting firms in the nation. I am a programmer. My favorite thing about programming, honestly, is that it's very logical. There's no room for error. It's very straightforward. You have 50 different paths to get to that one destination, but you can always get to that destination. It's not like drawing where like you start off with this idea and then your idea looks completely different. When programming, if you have an idea, it's, it's very easy to get to that idea. It's very structured. And that's why my favorite things of it is that you really get what you set out to do. Another thing I love a lot is drawing art, the beauty of creation. And that's probably why I love art. It's, it's transformative. You look at a picture and it could take you places. It's just a beauty of color and everything mixed together. And that's why it's just one of my favorite, favorite activities. As structured as I am with programming, I'm very unstructured when it comes to drawing. I start off sometimes doing line art and then I hate it and then I throw it away and then I just put color into it. And then sometimes I start off with color and then I realize I need some lines and so I draw lines and then I realize I don't want those lines and then I draw more color on it and then I realize I don't like any of it and then I redo it. I don't like sharing my art because the world is very cold and mean and scary. But I do share it on Tumblr, which I, I like the fact that it's anonymous. I just don't really want to attach a picture, like my personal face, with my art. It's not because I'm not proud of it, but people will judge you based on the way you look and your art. So you kind of just, I want to keep it separate. I want it to stand on its own. So like if it's bad, I want it, people to tell me it's bad. Not because they don't like me, it's just because it's bad. Or if it's good, then I want them to say it's good. Not because they know me not because I've done this other stuff, but because my art stands on its own. Polish is nice, but there's a lot of soul to like a drawing where their lines are like everywhere and you kind of see the creative process as it went along. Usually I draw a lot more women than I do guys. Uh, I don't know if it's subconscious or not, but I guess it's just not as appealing to me to draw guys because I'm not a dude. So it's not like I can relate too much to a guy. And it's more like I'm um, just, I don't feel really good with w the place I am at art to start drawing out there. I want to maintain something close to me for now, and then I'll move out. I do love butterflies, and I also love like swing sets. I love the circus theme. I love a little bit of darker stuff. I don't draw a lot of the darker stuff because I really don't want to express that side of me yet. But I, I do love more of like the free feeling dancer kind of vibe. The reason I actually got into programming was, like most people, to do games. And then I realized the industry is very, very harsh. They don't value talent as much as they should. And the turnover rate is abysmal. And they really don't understand how to treat their programmers well. But I do love programming for games. And the reason is that is it's fun, honestly, programming it and actually seeing people play it and playing it yourself. It's just, it's an instantaneous gratification of seeing your program work immediately. I am working with three other people on Chemist Out. There is Elton, Jonah, and Kat. I'll tell you who my favorite person is, it's Kat. We usually meet up to work on Al on Sundays. And we've been working on it like on and off two to three years now, just because we're all working full-time jobs. Also, some of them are going to school. And so we, we just make, we're making progress. We also jumped engines a few times. That was, that was not smart. It's great if you can do both programming and art, because honestly, that's where we're going. That's where we're heading towards. You have to be multi-talented. If you're a single talented person, you're not going to survive very long. There are too many people applying for the same jobs. You need to stand out. So you're going to have to be able to do both. If not programming itself and art together, you can do programming and some other, like biology. 
and there's also art and engineering in general, like being able to creatively design things are definitely in your favor because people respond to aesthetics now. We can we know people like things that are pretty, like iPad and Apple, like a lot of their stuff is because it looks nice and functions. So you have to be able to do both. Make sure you can do both.